My name is Carolyn Bain, and my business is Afori Books. If there's one word to sum up what I've done or who I am, it would be activist. In May 2020, George Floyd was murdered and my phone just started ringing because for years when my children were younger we had imported books from around the world to get representation, to find books that looked like us. So people were calling me and saying well where can I find that book for my children? I realised that, that our books are so white and so we thought okay we, you know we'd already started to slowly build the bookshop but even then the intention had only ever been to do a collection of 100 books to help out sort of friends and family, but that just blew up. I literally had a dream, and in the dream, I was in a bookshop, and people were in the bookshop, and they were bringing me books and saying, nobody wants this, will you take it? And I kept saying yes. And I just woke up thinking, maybe I need to get a bookshop where these unloved books can go, but I didn't know what the unloved books were at that time. When I first started out, the group that I would say were just there and are still there is there's a Facebook group called Women of Colour Brighton. In October 2020 I got this email saying would you be interested in opening a bookshop. I set up a meeting with Ali CEO of Lighthouse and I came away thinking actually maybe this is possible. To talk about the opening I have to go back to this moment where about four of us came in and physically built the bookshop. I just was like this is just too unreal this I just there are books on a shelf what's next definitely more community stuff I want to build community and I want you know, want to take away the shame the shame of asking questions of feeling like I need help and we need to create those spaces where people can do that I love this city the weirdness the quirkiness just it's who you are is who you are and so because I love it I want it to do better and I want to be part of, of helping it to do better.